tiny bundle of feathers has hatched out at Wingspan Birds of Prey Trust in Rotorua. At only three days old, Whisper, the moorpork, has to learn to survive without its parents. This little chick is very young to have started life in an artificial incubator, and even though it has around-the-clock care from the Wingspan team, it's touch and go. Early November, we were called by forestry contractors that had stumbled across a moorpork nest. And uh, a quick mercy dash out to the forest, and we rescued these two little eggs, which we put into the incubator. And just last week, this little one hatched. Wow. Now today, I think it's his, oh, it's his, his fourth day birthday. Yeah. When he hatched, he was only 21 grams. Oh, so he's half that size. Exactly, and in four days, it's remarkable growth. Wow. So how long we have to keep feeding him? We'll have to start um, giving him slightly bigger pieces of meat over the next week or so, but in, by two weeks' time, he should be able to pick the food himself. Um, and we'll start giving him moths as well, and. Um, uh, at the moment, he's been fed small pieces of meat, just like their parents would do in the nest. How many times a day do you have to feed him? He's been fed five times a day at the moment. He's been fed every three hours. Yeah. And then we check on him every three hours through the night as well. And do you think he's past that, the critical stage yet, or is it still kind of touch and go? A bit touch and go yet. Um, it, but another week of being anxious parents, I think. But he's doing so well. We're so pleased with him. The whiskers around the beak are very tactile, so what Mia is doing here is um, stimulating his feeding by touching those feathers around the beak, uh, because obviously he can't see them. And just like most kids, they don't like their face washed <laughs> before and afterwards either. But essentially at this age, aside from the temperature, we're monitoring constantly what goes in and also what comes out yeah. at the other end. New Zealand's last remaining native owl. They are threatened by habitat destruction and introduced predators, so they need all the help they can get. Thanks to the good folk at Wingspan, Young Whisper has a chance to grow up just like this one. Mm -hmm.